frustrating as an offense to score or to gain 500 some yards and not get more touchdowns out of it and come out on the losing end? Um, I mean, yeah, we put up a, the offense put up a good amount of numbers and you know, I feel like you know, this game has showed we can move the ball. I think now moving forward, we just got to focus on you know, executing, getting the ball in the, in, in the zone. And we have the running backs to do that. We have you know, the skill players to do that, the tight ends to do that, the line to do that. I mean, if not, we wouldn't have been moving the ball on them like, like that. So we just got to keep on improving, and that's all we can really do. I mean, we got, we got to execute. We got to put the ball in the zone. You guys scored a, make it a one score game. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I forget what it was, 30. 34-26, and they, they have the kickoff return. When you scored to make it 34-26, mm -hmm. what did you feel at that point? That you I, mean, I mean, the thing with, thing with us and the people on the sidelines saying the whole game, we're not going to stop till the clock hits zero. And, you know, Matt Johns pulled the offense together and said, just keep going, keep battling. And that's, and that's what we did um, you know, when we were down and scored. So we just got to keep on. We just, I mean, we don't give up, man. As we just don't give up. We don't stop. Did you see what happened to Grayson out there? I'm um, not. I, I did not see that. I did not see. Was it just kind of? I mean, you guys have seen this before. Matt comes in and mm. relieves Grayson and, and does well. Mm. Same type of feeling for the offense. Didn't skip a beat. Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, that's just the. We're fortunate to have you know quarterbacks that can step in when when someone gets hurt or someone whatever is, and, and they can come in and play well. I mean, that's the same with the wide receivers, same with the tight ends, same with the running backs. I mean. We have we have depth and our, our coaches, our team. We trust anyone that's in the game. But the just the play of the receivers, especially mm -hmm. Miles. I mean, yeah. guy catches everything. And yeah. It's hard to believe this guy was a former quarterback not too long ago. I know. Uh, talk a little about what he's I brought mean, to this team. I mean, I, I would have to go back to his work ethic. This dude works hard. I mean, and he deserves everything he he gets. I mean, there was some big plays on third down. He just comes for a twenty yard pass. I mean, like you said. This is the quarterback, twin wide receiver. So when you see that, that's just that's that's huge. And if we can just keep getting to him, you know, ball in his hands, and keep getting the receivers, you know, conversions, we should we should be good. We just gotta keep on moving forward. You see teams in your own league that don't mm -hmm. haven't played the schedule you yeah. have to this point. Yeah. Do you think how much do you think playing UCLA and mm -hmm. BYU is going to help help you the next two months? I, it, it helps us tremendously. I mean, like you said, those are our first four games have been some some tough ones, you know. And I think moving forward, it shows we're battle tested. I mean, that, that's I mean, that's something moving forward that we're, we're going to have to notice about ourselves as a team. We're, we're battle tested.